to find something to be grateful about when you're sad and when you're down you gotta like you gotta search what am I happy about What's up guys, making the breakfast of champions. I already cooked up some link sausage and I was gonna add it, I was gonna make an omelet with these veggies. I was gonna add the link sausage in there, but instead I've been eating them while I'm cooking. <laughs> I can't help myself, I'm hungry. Mm. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna add me some eggs in there and some cheese. I think it'll be pretty good. Well, yeah. Breakfast of Champions. Let's go. Mmm, that's good sausage. Mm-hmm. You want some of that? Mmm. You want, you want some like sausage? <laughs> you want this? There you go. He's a good boy. Mm-hmm. Good dog. And there we have it. That there, guys, is my omelet. And that is going to be cake to the pan, so that's going to be fun to clean. What's <laughs> up, guys? Hit my dumbbells before I go off to work. Alright guys, I'm heading off to work. I'll see y'all later. What's up guys, what's going on? Well, it's been a busy day. I made a decent amount of money. I could have worked an extra hour, but I'm just not feeling it right now. Uh, I'm going through emotional stuff. I gotta just stop. It's hard though. You know. When someone just like cuts you out of their life, disappears completely and you care so much for him it, it hurts and I just can't stop caring that's what I need to do is just I gotta quit quit caring but it's easier said than done so anyway <clears throat> I'm gonna head home and uh, make some kind of food. I don't know what I'm going to eat. I don't know. But, uh, gotta get my ass on that dating site and see if I can meet somebody tonight. Cause, damn. I don't see any other way of moving on. It's rough. I've been trying to do it this morning like on the dating site and I just I haven't got a whole lot of uh, matches. I got like I got like five matches basically, and then like two unmatched me for some odd freaking reason. <laughs> and uh, the ones that I have matched still, like I've tried to communicate and make small talk with them, and they just don't even respond. So I don't even know like if they just abandon the dating site or what the hell. But it sucks. It's like there's no one to talk to. It's, I don't know. I'm just gonna have to keep trying or eventually give up on this site and then go sign up for a different site. It just sucks when you pay them your hard earned money for their highest upgraded membership and you got nothing, you know? It's like, wow. Waste of money, waste of time, seems like. I don't know. You know, I, I used to be good at like finding positive and everything, but it's like right now I just. I guess I'm just too sad to find positive. I'm trying. 
Gotta be strong, damn it. But yeah, she basically blocks me on all her social media. She doesn't talk to me anymore. I've tried. I even contacted one of her friends to see if like she could talk to her to maybe get her to talk to me. Like all I want to be is friends at this point. It's just friends and nothing more. It just hurts that I can't even have that, you know? This doesn't seem fair to me. And as I said before, I mean if she doesn't care then why should I care? But I do. Tears me up. Tears me up inside, man. I, uh, I gave a ride to a gal earlier who said uh, she's in a long distance relationship. I don't know why, but she got in my car and she says, do you have any advice for someone in a long distance relationship? <laughs> she actually asked me that. Like, how the hell did she know to ask me? And my advice was, don't do it. No. <laughs> Rick. I don't know, man. I just, I told her it's hard, you know. I was honest. Like, it's hard. And it takes hard work to make it work. And you gotta trust each other. And, you know. It's hard to do that. I think you just gotta have lots of video chat. And you gotta actually meet up, you know. You gotta have a time when you're gonna meet. You can't say maybe here or maybe there or oh, maybe I can't do it then. Or you gotta have a set time written in stone. Like this is the day we are gonna meet. You know? See, I never had that. I never had that. That's part of the reason why I was crazy. And you know, just, yeah. Anyway, enough talking about it. Uh, but as far as the gal, she said she's going to meet with her guy. He's coming from, like, Utah or something like that. And they're going to meet up, uh, like, this week or something. That's crazy. That's cool, though. I, I like it when, you know, there's success stories and stuff. I just it's hard to hear everybody else's success story and then my shit just failed but you know what man whenever you fail at something in life you just get back up and you come back ten times stronger and that's what's gonna happen with me it's just I'm not ready to be strong yet I'm gonna want to be but I'm not rough. That's why I gotta meet someone local over here. And I'm sure gonna try tonight. <laughs> Dedicate a lot of time to it tonight. Because I gotta have something to look forward to. I gotta feel hopeful. gotta feel happiness I need that I need happiness I don't feel like I got that right now and I I'm disappointed in myself today because today I didn't have like that excuse like I wasn't all hung over I could have worked out, but instead I've messed around on the damn dating site this morning. <laughs> instead of working out, like all I did was the dumbbells earlier. I, I could have ran the treadmill or hit my heavy bag, and I would have felt better about myself. Instead I was on a dating site trying to meet somebody, and had no success so far, so I'm just kind of bummed. Like I struck out and didn't get a workout in either. But I 
made money today, so I should be grateful for that. That's the thing, you know, you just, you gotta find something to be grateful about. When you're sad and when you're down, you gotta like, you gotta search. What am I happy about? I made money today. I'm gonna be able to pay my bills. You know, that's important. I mean, I'm, I'm self-employed now. I'm making it happen though. But yeah, I gotta worry about paying taxes. So, I'm not out of the woods yet, you know? I gotta like figure the figures out and come up with that money so I can pay my taxes. not all fun and games. It's an easy job. It's cruise and just cruise around and listen to music. And, you know, it's, it's enjoyable when you're not sad and thinking about someone you lost. I was good all day pretty much till like last couple hours. Last three hours really. It's like you, you stop thinking about it and then it just kind of reverts back again and again and again. No matter how hard you try to block it out. <sighs> it's crazy. You know how hard I try to be positive for you guys? I try no matter what to paint a positive picture motivate you guys and you know if I'm happy then I mean, hopefully you'll be happy um, at least that's what I try to do today doesn't seem like I'm doing that today we're failing <laughs> we are a failure today but that doesn't mean we will be tomorrow Anyway, guys, I'm heading home. I'm almost home. I'm gonna, I'm gonna cook food. I don't know. I got beer to drink, but I don't want to be that guy that drinks every day. Try not to be, but <laughs> I don't know. No telling what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I guess that's another thing to be thankful for. I have the freedom to do whatever I please. Anyways, guys, I appreciate y'all. You guys are awesome. And always providing me with support and advice. Positivity. So thank you. Smash that like if you guys would. Subscribe if you haven't already. Share this on your social media if you would. And yeah, appreciate y'all. Good night. And peace out.